God gives me the names of angels for other people. I know the names of most of my angels, but you just got assigned a new angel. The spelling is T-O-C-H-E. Magical thinking is often the result of substantial family of origin trauma and self-denial or disassociation. Many people have adopted this stronghold of the enemy that has to do with emotional thinking and a detachment from logic and reason. In other words, the decision to, to believe the things we want to believe rather than coming in contact with and living in the veracity of the truth. The Bible calls this people who refuse to love the truth and to so be saved. Therefore, God sends them a strong delusion so that they might believe what is false in order that they might be condemned who did not believe the truth but had pleasure in unrighteousness. I know that there's a time frame as recovery from trauma takes place in which people want to believe things, believe in special powers, special abilities, special capabilities, which God has not promised and which you have not seen come to pass. You are falling in to the great delusion and deception. Believe the truth of God's word. Lift up your hands. So there's an angel standing in between me and you. It's 15 angels. To weaponize 15 people. Yeah, Y'all crazy. Hold on. Jesus. God, can I ask for some more uh, angels or something? Y'all some crazy folks. Now, oh God, are my guys ready? Oh Jesus. So, I'm going to let my angels do what they do. But it's 15 angels with prayer assignments. So, let me move out the way before y'all knock me over. Somebody move this stuff out of the way. Because in a second, 15 crazy people are about to run up here. Now... And I'm not going to touch you because, you know, I, I don't really do anything. But for these 15 people, God says the things that you are about to shift in this nation. Let me just, let me move out of the way. You're you going to keep me safe, right? Because they're going to try to trip me. All right, here we go. Jeez, I feel sorry for those in the back because y'all. Y'all know the craziest people up here, right? All right, here we go. I didn't say go yet now. Yo, listen, listen. Some of y'all got one foot up. Now, don't play with this because these are very special angels. So when I count to three, oh, let me move out of the way. I keep forgetting these folks crazy because these my warriors. When I count to three, 15 of y'all run on the stage. I didn't count yet, so. One. Let me just look and see who's crazy. Woo! Yeah. I didn't. Yeah. I didn't say three. I'm just trying to see if y'all ready. Woo! Woo! Oh, these are big angels. Let me. One, two, three. Come on.
longer into trances. As they will be on special prayer assignments. But guess what? Their angels still walk in these pews right now. Hey, I said, there's angels walking these pews. And the fire is still falling. And the glory. You can expect a miracle in the next seven days. I don't have to make up a word, but I heard the Holy Ghost. If you are praising, you can expect a miracle. Seven days, seven days, seven days, seven days, seven days, seven days. Come on, I dare you to praise right there. Seven days from now, let me count. You want to mark the calendar. Seven days. Seven days. Seven days. It won't be late. It won't be late. It won't come. a little churchy. We commanded an open wide. He will no longer feel blocked. He will no longer feel isolated. Mary and Come on, someone push it in the spirit. Great doors of favor. And no man will stop it, no man will block it, no man will curse it, no witch will curse it. There's a great mantle, I see Samson's mantle. I hear the Lord say, I've been waiting on a strong man that show no tendencies. Hey, I've been waiting on someone that I can raise up with the strength of Samson. You're looking at our modern day Samson who will slay giants. And let me tell you something. There are people keep praying in the Holy Ghost. You just have our own right there.